This right here is the Trimax Combination Cable Lock. What this is gonna allow you to do is pick four numbers to lock your stuff up. This could be used for all the different sports and rec type stuff. What we're using it on right now is a bike. So if your bike rack didn't come with a cable, then you can use this one. Or if you lost your keys and you don't wanna have to deal with keys anymore, combination lock is always my go-to just because nothing to lose. You just have to remember that number. On one end, we're gonna have the piece that goes into our lock. And on the other end, we're gonna have a little loop and you're just gonna have to wrap it around. It is about 10 foot long, which is plenty. If you do have a four bike rack, I think uh, it'll go throughout the whole entire rack and still be able to have plenty of room to get everything going. This is a very long cable, some of them around four or five feet. Sometimes I can get a little too small. It all just depends on where you're tying down and what you're tying down. I really like the length of the cable and I also like the size. It is 5 16ths in diameter, so it's not too big. It can fit through some of the smaller sections of my bike, but I do like how it has the little coating around it. That's just gonna prevent any scratches. I'm just trying to protect my gear from getting stolen and I don't want it to get scratched just from me trying to protect it. So I do think this is gonna be a pretty good option for you. So let's show you exactly how to reset it. Right out of the box, it's going to have a combination of zero, 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 and one. See how it's all in line with this little black strip? So once that's done, you can take the lock off. So then what you wanna to do to reset this combination on the lock, when it's in the unlocked position with no cable connected to it, we're gonna rotate this counterclockwise. It's gonna come off like this. And then we can take all of these numbers off and we can set it to something else. We just wanna make sure it's all in line with this little black strip right here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do 48 and 48 again. You don't wanna lose these things. Once you have your desired combination, I love 48s, because it's easy to remember for me. You can take this, kinda of line it up. It'll fall into place and then you can rotate it back. And then we can put it back on, scramble it up, and we're good to go. So now when we're ready, four, eight, four, eight, done deal. So it's very easy to reset the combination. And then whenever we're done, notice how the zeros are a little bit elevated more so than the rest of the numbers. Line those up, and then we have this little rubber strip, this little cover right here which is gonna go on there just to prevent it from getting any moisture buildup or anything like that. That's pretty much it for our look at the Trimax combination cable lock.